So for this video, I'm going to be going over how to get a cop belt. Since in the last video that I made on it, most people couldn't get it to work. So I'm going to be doing it again to show you guys that it's working. So you're going to be able to put it on, I think, almost any outfit. But I'm not really sure. But I'm going to be putting it, putting it on um, a black jogger's outfit. So you don't have to, um, you don't need to own the black joggers because we're going to be getting them um, later on anyway from the glitch. So put on the outfit that you don't want to lose first because you are going to be losing all your other outfits. So let's put on the outfit you don't want to lose first before doing the glitch. And then when you're ready to um, do the glitch, you also want to make sure that you have purchased either a rebreather or this earpiece before doing the glitch. So let's go to ammunition and purchase either a rebreather or any earpiece. So to start the glitch, just hit your pause button, go to online and go into swap character. So when the two characters come walking in, you want to go over to your, over to your second character. And if you don't see um, edit on your second character, go ahead and delete that second character. And then when the two new characters walk in, you should see the edit button. But if you see the edit button, just go ahead and select your second character. And then you're going to get this alert right here. And when you get it, you just want to go ahead and accept it. It's going to ask you if you want to copy your stuff over. Just go ahead and accept it. And when your characters come in here, if your character was a male, if your second character was a male, just go ahead and change it into a female. But if, if it was already a female, just go ahead and um, save and continue, uh, make a random name for it, and then take the picture. And then after that, it's going to load you into the casino DLC trailer. So once you load inside a new session, you just want to go ahead and open up your mini map. And if you don't see any clothing stores on your mini map, just go ahead and um, find a new session or just switch sessions. So there's no clothing stores on my mini map. So I'm just going to go ahead and go find a new session. So when you when you um, get spawned inside a new session, you should see the clothing stores on your mini map. But if there were clothing stores on your mini map, just go ahead and make your way over to any of the clothing stores. So we just got loaded inside of our new session. We're just gonna open up our mini map, and as you can see, it's a whole bunch of clothing stores. Now you just wanna go ahead and make your way over to um, whichever clothing store you want. So when you get to the clothing store, go ahead and go to the top section, go to gun running t-shirts, and go ahead and purchase the um, blue digital t-shirt. So go, go to the top section, go to gun running t-shirts, and purchase the blue really digital t-shirt, which should be all the way today at the bottom and just go back into the top section again and go to work jackets i went to work t-shirts by accident but just go to um work jackets and go ahead and purchase the peach camo clothes field so go back to the top section go to work jackets work jackets and purchase the peach camo clothes field so after you purchase that just make your way over to the pants section go to the um, sport pants and go ahead and purchase the spotted muscle pants so go to the pants section go to sport pants and go ahead and purchase the um, spotted muscle pants which should be the first ones when you click on them so after you purchase that hey, now you just want to make your way over to the shoe so section go to high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat so go to the shoe section and go to high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat So after you purchase that, you're going to make your way over to accessories. And if your character has any earrings on, go ahead and take the earrings off. I think, my, yeah, my character had earrings on, so I'm going to go ahead and go take them off. So make sure you take off the earrings off your character. So when you finish taking the earrings off your character, just go to the um, glove section, which should be in the accessories. Go to the gloves and go ahead and purchase the light woodland tactical, which should be number four. So just purchase the light woodland tactical gloves. And after it, that's it for this outfit. You go ahead and come and save it. And when you save it, make sure you don't save it in the same slot that your main character has the outfit you don't want to lose in. So if my main character has that outfit with the yellow joggers in slot 20, I would save this in a different slot. So just save it in a slot that your main character has the outfit on that you don't want to lose in. So once you save the outfit in any other slot, go ahead and um, hit around the D-pad and this lady again. Go to standard outfits and go ahead and purchase the Chica outfit. And then just hit your pause button, go to online and just go into creator.
So once you get into creator, go ahead and go to creator race, and then you want to go to land race. So once you load in, just go ahead and click on race details, and go ahead and fill out the title and description. And the description. It doesn't have to be anything specific, just random stuff for it. And then go to the maximum players and set it on two, and then go to the root type and put it on point to point, and then just hit your pause button, and then go ahead and warp over to the airport. So after you get to the airport, just go ahead and hit B, go to placement, go ahead and place the triggers, and then back out, and you're gonna take the lobby camera, and then when you back out again, after the lobby camera, you're gonna go ahead and place the checkpoints, and make sure the race has to be only, for this race, it has to be only 0 .60, um, three miles, 0 0.62 miles or longer. So just make the race either 0 0.63 miles or 0.64 miles, as long as it's more than 0.62 miles. So after you make the race, just go ahead and hit B twice, so it gives you the option to um, test out the race, and go ahead and test out your race. So after you finish the race, you're gonna get that alert right there. Go ahead and accept it, and then when you accept it, it should spawn you in. When it spawns you in, just hit your pause button, go to online, and just go into um, choose character. So when you get in here, you go over to your second character and hit delete on her. So make sure you're in your second character, not your main character. Go over to your second character that has a Chica outfit on, just go ahead and hit delete on her. And then it's gonna ask you to confirm it and all that. And then when the two new characters come walking in, you just wanna go ahead and hit B so it backs you out to single player or story mode. So when these two characters come walking in, just go ahead and hit B so it backs you out to single player or story mode. So when you get into single player, just go ahead and hit your pause button, go to online, go to play GT online, and just go into invite only session. So once you spawn inside your, um, your session, go ahead and go save the outfit that you didn't want to lose. So I'm just gonna, gonna go ahead and come and save this. After you save it, go ahead and um, put on whatever whatever outfit that you want to put the cop belt on. But I'm gonna be putting putting them on the black joggers. So to put it on the black joggers, I'm just gonna go ahead and um, take my top off, take my accessories off, and I'm gonna put on the black utility heist pants because those are gonna um, end up being the black joggers. So if you don't have any outfits yet that you want to put the um, cop belt on, you can go ahead and copy what I'm doing and you're gonna end up getting the um, cop belt on the black joggers with the um I think the white smart shoes which is basically the um, white shoes with the socks on them but yeah just go ahead and put on the outfit that you want to put the cop belt on and then just wait till I'm done making outfits so right now I'm just taking off the accessories make sure you also take off the we accessories of your, um, of your character all right so once you've got the outfit that you want to put the cop belt on Go ahead and hit your pause button, go to um, online, go to jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created, go to versus and start up the job called Crooked Cops. And when you start up that job, you just want to go ahead and invite either a friend or a random, doesn't matter. And then the most important thing is you want to put the clothing on player owned. So make sure you put the clothing on player owned or the glitch isn't going to work and invite either a friend or a random to help you out. So when your friend joins, you just want to go ahead and go to the owned outfits, hit right on the d-pad once and as you can see, we got a cop belt on our outfit and then it's gonna end up it's gonna end up being being black joggers with um the white smart shoes i think they're white smart shoes with um the socks so once you load inside the job just go ahead and hit um, open up your interaction menu go to your um, styles go to accessories and put on either an earpiece or rebreather just go ahead and open up your interaction menu go to your um, styles accessories and put on a rebreather or an earpiece and then go ahead and open up your phone and you want to quit the job and then after you quit the job you should spawn inside um your new session with the um cop belt on your outfit whichever one you decide to put it on so from there you could go on um, excuse me you can go save the outfit in ammunition and make sure you save it towards the bottom if you want to merge any outfits with the cop belt so once you save that or you can just delete the um, component since 
or I don't know if you want to um, merge it onto your other outfits go ahead and um, keep the component but if you don't care about the component just go ahead and delete it and then you go ahead and go save this outfit and then you get to keep it so that's gonna be for this video if you guys enjoyed it don't get to drop a like on it share it subscribe and then we'll turn your post notifications